Mary Kay back tracking showers on the way, Mary Kay. After midnight, Joe and Erica, our shower chances increase, but all that mild air is well south of a 75 St. Louis, 71 Kansas City. We are at 47 degrees with that breeze off the lake. So it is a northeast wind now at 15 miles per hour. That is keeping things much cooler lakeside. So 47 Lincoln Park. Skokie has 46. We're at 49 now in LaGrange, and Lyle has 48 degrees. Same for you in Whiting. Clouds have moved in as well, but we're not seeing the rain shower activity just yet, but we will. We are going to bring that rain chance in after midnight. Then we're going to watch the progression of this warm front during the day tomorrow. Here is Wednesday afternoon, and it is going to be a tale of two seasons. We will have it much cooler north of the Stevenson all the way up to the Wisconsin line with readings in the 50s. Then south of this warm front, you could almost touch 70 degrees in Newton and Jasper County. So it depends where you live as far as how mild it will be, but everybody has that chance to see a passing shower, especially as we go through the evening evening hours and then the front will finally push away for us and then we start to see some drier air work in for Thursday afternoon. This is one o'clock as we will be in the 50s. So for tonight, cloudy skies with that rain chance after midnight 46 for the overnight low. Tomorrow we have scattered rain around. It's 40% with a wind off the lake, especially north of that warm front. So holding in the 50s. Then on Thursday, skies clear out, but we stay cool because once that cold front comes in, it ushers in a cooler air mass. So here's the wide view of it. So you can see how the scattered showers line up ahead of this warm front for the daytime hours. Once the low crosses east of us, it drags the shower chances through in the evening for us. Rain amounts, though, are not impressive. We are seeing minor amounts of rain with this tenth of an inch, maybe a quarter inch rain, but it's really minimal for us. So the forecast as we reach into the weekend, well, let's not forget the Bears play Thursday night, and it looks nice, but I think the winds will be out of the west at 10 to 20, but we are expecting a clear sky with temperatures in the 40s, mainly middle 40s for much of the game. And then for the Veterans Day weekend, temperatures are more seasonable. This is actually where we should be this time of year, right at about 50 to the lower 50s, and we will be there as a strong ridge of high pressure builds in. Check out this pattern, very dry as we reach into next week. In fact, our 10 day trend is showing that we will cool down on the weekend. But Joe and Erica, I see warmer weather coming mm. our way all over again next week. How about that? <sighs> Thanks, Mary Kay.